Hi everyone, welcome back to a new video. So in this video, we are going to discuss on how to set Inco terms in Odoo 16. Inco term is an international commercial term used during a business. Inco terms are published by International Chamber of Commerce. So let us see how to set Inco term. So for that, let me go to the accounting module. And here you have the configuration settings. So let me go to the settings. And let me enable the feature in core terms. So you have the option to display in core terms on orders and invoices, and you also have the option to set default in core term. So let me set a default in core term here and save it. So after saving the settings, if you go to the configuration settings. Let me go here and you can see here the Inco terms. So if you want to configure or create a new info Inco term, you can create a new Inco term from here. And uh, Inco terms are helpful terms used to facilitate international trade. They are separated by modes of transport between any modes. And you can see here the pre-configured Inco terms in Udu. So after that, uh, you can just go to the sales module. And you can create a new quotation. So let me add the customer. And I'll give a product here in the order line. And if you go to the other info tab, you can see here the inco term. And if you want to add the inco term, you can add the inco term. And let me confirm it. So after confirming it, let me create a invoice for the sales order. So let me create the invoice. And if you go to the invoice, so you can also see the Inco term here. So you can see the Inco term which we have set for this sales order. So this is how you set the Inco term. And if you go to the purchase module and create an RFQ, you can also set the Inco term there. So let me create a RFQ. I'll add the vendor and here let me add the product. So if you go to the other info you can see the inco term here and you can add the inco term as you have done in the sales order and after that i'll confirm the order and receive the product validate it after validating the product now i can create a bill for this product so when you are creating the bill, you can see the Inco term here, which we have set for this product and we can just confirm the bill from here. So you have to add the bill date. Confirm it. So you can see it is in page state. So this is how you set Inco terms in Odoo 16. So that's all for today. Thank you.